Hi guys, welcome to this session in LibreOffice Calc. In this module, I want to show you how you can add a spark line to your data set. So on the screen, I've got some data, just January to December, with some figures in there. What I want is a spark line at the end there, which gives me the high low points. So first of all, I'm going to highlight this data, right click, and on the right mouse click, you've got spark lines, and then you've got spark line. You've also got group and ungroup. So I'll just click on this one first off, just to create this first one. So it's picking up the range that I selected. Where I want this, so it says range. Now, if I'd have selected the whole thing, in fact, I will do that. I'll select the whole thing. Otherwise, it's just going to do one on this little cell here. I'll just close that for a second and select all of this data. Right click, spark line, spark line, and then that's the range. And the output range is going to be this area in column N. So I've opened that back up. So you've got options in here of different styles, column, line, stacked. I'll leave it on line. And then you've got these options, negative points, red, high points, which I'm going to tick, and low points. So high point I will have as um, green and low point I'll, I'll leave it as red. Now if I click OK to that, you get the spark line coming in there. And if this data changes, so the high point in this example is October. If I change that to a lower number, that will just flick over. And then you've got two low points, three and four, or two, three, should I say. If I put that to one, that will be the lowest point, and this just reacts. So if I highlight the group, right click, back into Spark Lines, and edit Spark Line Group, takes me back into this area, and I can change this from, say, for example, a line to a column. You can change some of the colours if you don't like the colours. But I'll just click OK to that for now. And then you've got that change in there. So the colour high, so if I change one of these other cells to a higher number, 66 for example, that will just react to that. So that's a spark line, like a mini little chart that sits in the back of a cell looking at this data. If you don't want it, you can just delete it. Slightly easier than in Excel, because in Excel you have to clear contents, but this, you just have to just click on it and press delete. So it's not a chart as such but it looks like a chart so it's quite useful where you've got data i'll just undo that so they come back where you've got data like this where it's just comparing months on months you just want a visual there of your high low points that's what you can do so that's just a very quick video of how you can use spark lines in LibreOffice calc so hopefully this video has been of use thank you for your time and i'll catch you on the next one